Alrighty, so you're here today with Sergeant Femith. We're gonna talk about body mechanics and different body positions today. Okay, so we're gonna go over a couple ones. We're gonna go over standing, which is the most common. Standing, kneeling is another one. And then prone, which is a known one in the military. There's also one we're gonna go over, which is kind of unorthodox in this uh, environment, but we're gonna go over it anyway. The sideways position. This is used for shooting under a vehicle and more on the civilian side as well. So, begin with M4. Make sure it's clear. Right? Start uh, using an empty magazine. Okay. Go over the standing position. So, this position be used uh, most commonly. You just want to put rounds on the enemy. Right? So, you have essentially, you have your legs uh, parallel, a good standing position, kind of a shoulder width length. Right? Then you'd have a good kind of grip on your, on your rifle. You're going to want to pocket this. This butt stock, right in between your shoulder pocket, and you kind of want to, in a sense, you kind of want to round it over. You want to round your shoulder over the butt stock where it kind of sucks it in, right? So either way I go, it's just sucked in, okay? So as we're right here behind this tree, you don't want to hug it. You don't want to get too close on the barrier where where you're just you're you're incapable of anything and you're just you're, you're exposing yourself and essentially you're just going to get yourself killed, right? So you want to. Kind of a hand, hand's length, you want to have a little little space to move to still see them. So standing, essentially. Right, standing. And then right from standing, it's the same thing as kneeling. You just drop the, you drop your knee. So you drop the knee. So this would be kneeling position. Okay. And then obviously, see, watch my body and how I am. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not all the way over here, as you can tell. I'm not, a, I'm not exposing my whole body or I just like, hey, check me out. I'm putting my, my exposing my, my chest and my vital organs to the enemy. I'm not doing none of this. I'm, I'm silhouetting myself behind the tree, using the cover and concealment, right? Getting good enough space, and I'm, and I'm just barely just, barely just peeping out, right? And trying to just expose as little as my flesh as possible, okay? Now, prone position. You're gonna get a little dirty. It is what it is, right? Right? The so prone position, right? This one you're gonna have the most points of contact on the ground. This one you're gonna have the most accurate shots. You're gonna have you're gonna be the lower the lowest silhouette. Now there are some there are gonna be a lot of negatives to this as well. It is hard to move from this. I can't really get up and, and position myself in a fast manner in this position. Alright, the quickest way to get up from this position position would be your left hand. Right here on the ground, push up to a knee, and then essentially you can go right, right back to standing. So now we went over standing, kneeling, and now prone. Okay. Now the other one I want to show you. This one is for shooting under a vehicle, and this is going to be very useful. Okay. So obviously I don't have a vehicle here. Let's say for example. This is the front axle, this is the back axle, and in between is the bottom of the vehicle, for example, okay? So, you're gonna get down, right? As you're down, you wanna kick your left leg out, left leg goes out, and essentially, you wanna do the same technique of rolling your shoulder over this buttstock and, and pushing this thing into your torso and making sure that thing stays in there close, okay? And then essentially you get this position here, and this would also mitigate uh, the rifle uh, rifle orientation, okay? Because if you're shooting prone under a vehicle, and you start shooting, where's that rifle usually going? It's gonna go up, right? It's gonna go up. But if we're shooting sideways, right, we're mitigating the, the direction of the rifle and all the aspects in that nature. Okay. Back. Oh, we're good. Okay. All right, ready? Yep. Ready. Stand by. Up. So that's how you shoot under a vehicle. All right. So now we're going to go over how to switch your silhouette. Okay. Of course, just take your take your hand and your head out of your seat. Okay. 
maybe one arm, maybe one arm it. All right, so yes, a lot of us are gonna be right hand dominant. I'm right hand dominant, but still situation dictates when sometimes you have to move to your left side, okay? Say for example, I'm taking contact and I'm standing and the threat starts moving left, my left, his right on me if we're trying to flank me, right? Yes, I can just move out my left body and still hold up that same position, but look what I just did. Now I just exposed my whole left side of my body. Now I just, instead of silhouetting a smaller portion of my body, now I just gave him all this flesh for him to penetrate with rounds, right? So essentially, now he can shoot my arm, my leg, my head, everything, everything down the line, essentially, right? So, to change these factors and get the, and get the, and change the outcome on your enemy, what you want to do is, essentially, it's kind of a head game. It's going to be a little scramble at first. You want to play it, play it, play it kind of smooth. Slow is smooth and smooth is fast, all right? So first you want to move buttstock, 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 right? Essentially. So the buttstock to buttstock, okay? Then it's hand to hand, okay? So once the buttstock changes, now the hands change. Now once all this changes, then you switch your eyes, okay? So now we're switching everything from our right dominant to our left dominant, okay? So now we're going, now we're going from right to buttstock, hand, hand, and now we're switching eyes and we're switching our orientation on our legs, okay? So we're picking up and we're still doing the same same fundamentals. We're still rolling our shoulder over the buttstock, okay? And we're still picking up the same side picture, but now look, look what we have silhouetted. We only have a little bit of our, a little portion of our head now. Instead of the whole left side of our body, right? Now we only have that bit of flesh exposed to the enemy. Okay, and then we just, the same, the same movements. You drop the left, you drop the left knee, right? And then go. Everything, everything is the same. Nothing changes. Everything is the same. Okay. Even if you think about it, even even the sideways position, us on the ground shooting under the vehicle. Okay. Even that position there. That's essentially the same position of us standing. Okay. That's the same position of us standing. Think about it. We're standing. Right now, what do we do if we just lay our body over? Right. What, what is that the same? What is that the same position of? Now, it's the same position as, as standing. The same position as the standing, the sideways, the bo same body mechanic, right? If you think about it. good situation of awareness okay so yeah those are the body mechanics uh, study them and know when to use them and what situation to use them in okay like I said standing is the most common so when you stand you're standing here when you kneel you're kneeling here when you take a prone you are prone here but you must remember when you go into all these body positions that you must behind stay behind cover so you want to stay at a minimal distance and know when to change buttstock and hand legs and eye know when to change the outcome on the enemy okay that's our infamous that is going over the different body mechanics and i hope you can tune in for our next follow-up vlog thank you ready thank you, your mind. Oh, yo. Before. Bye -bye.
stop shapeless. Like water. When you put water into a cup, it becomes the cup. You put water into a bottle, it becomes the bottle. When you put it in a teapot, it becomes the teapot. Now water can flow. How it can flow. And water, my friend. 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 Alrighty.